Hey friends, it's Mrs. Hill. Welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you have joined me for another book. Today's book is titled Tooting Santa's Magical Cookies. And this is by Fun Skill Brew. Today's super special shout out goes to Haley, Audrina, and Evan. Thank you guys so much for listening to this book. And I heard that maybe you like farting books. So I'm so glad that you are back for another book. I hope you guys love this one. Let's get started. This Christmas Eve, amid snow so white, Mrs. Claus prepared special cookies tonight. It was the season of gifts and baked goods of yummy kinds, but also of narrow escapes and stinky farts that blow minds. So the elves couldn't give this opportunity a miss. Making toys for boys and girls was pure bliss. Elfie the elf exclaimed, Dear Santa, all gifts are wrapped tight. Then Santa rewarded him a raisin and choco cookie delight. After taking a big bite, Elfie let out a wide and windy pop. <coughs> hopping and hopping, he filled the sleigh with gifts nonstop. <coughs> While loading the sleigh for gals and lads, his gut exploded like a firecracker, really bad. He secretly let out a silent and stinky bell, <coughs> which caused all the elves to run, gag, and yell. Yet Santa cheerfully grinned and giggled as his plump tummy wiggled and wiggled. Then Santa and his reindeers took a special flight. Lego, his reindeer, had to guide the sleigh tonight. The air traffic got super busy during the peak hour. Santa's toots saved the night and provided the power. <coughs> the sleigh dashed with lightning speed. The cookies gas galore really took heed. All at once, Mr. Santa's sleigh arrived on Jack's rooftop. Indeed, that was his first and most smelly stop. While climbing into his chimney with his sack, he was so chubby he plopped onto his back. As he got stuck, he began to shout, I won't be able to deliver the gifts if I don't get out! In turn, he let out a whopper, louder than a jingle bell. <coughs> he slid down the chimney near the Christmas tree quite well. Next, Santa placed the gift near the Christmas tree, but couldn't find a way to flee. This situation has me really stuck. It is my job tonight. I need some luck. Then he let out a ripper in a go. He zoomed out of the chimney with a ho, ho, ho. <coughs> Delivering the gifts was taking too long, but they were to be delivered to whom they belong. Mr. Santa shared his special cookies with his reindeer Lego. Delivering all the gifts was still a long way to go. Some super turbo power is what we need. Santa boomed. Lego stuck his bubbling bottom in the air and off they zoomed. <coughs> Meanwhile, Snowy was feeling so much unease. He shouted, Oh, dear Santa, help me, please. Snowy cried, My icy tummy is really rumbling. 
He needed something to keep from fainting and tumbling. As a result, Santa gave Snowy a special cookie to help. But he melted after a steamy ripper that made him yelp. Lego screamed out, now what should we do? Santa replied, let's try and make him brand new. Then Santa and the reindeers did their part. They made the snowman with teamwork and heart. Snowy said merrily, finally, I feel perfectly right. His brand new frozen look was an absolute delight. Now Santa was very sleepy and really slow. Lego's tooting was needed to keep the flow. Lots of gifts to boys and girls were already delivered. Lego let out the wake-up alarm toots whenever required. <sniffs> Wake up, Santa! Next, on the way back to the North Pole, they met a polar bear with such a jolly soul. He whispered, I have a skiing competition to play. Dear Santa, what gift do you have for me today? So Santa gave him the magical cookie with a wink. With a tooting power, he left everyone behind in a blink. <laughs> After delivering the gifts to all the lovely kids on the map, Mr. Claus and his crew reached the North Pole to nap. We've had the craziest time. Mr. Claus told his dear wife. This Christmas I've had the most gas of my life. Mrs. Claus giggled. <laughs> my magical cookies were packed with special powers. I'll also eat them next year and then toot and toot for hours. If you notice a lingering smell this Christmas day, just look up to the sky and you may see Santa on his way. I hope you love this story by Fun Skill Brew. I will link all of their information in the description box below where you can purchase this book or one of their many other books for your library at home. Thank you for tuning in. Can't wait to read to you in the next book. See you soon. Happy holidays.